All right, guys. I'm going to show you in this video how I do my research. Um, you can so you can go about researching a shirt. Just very basic. Uh, think of like a uh, a word, right? And then I'm going to show you how you're going to actually use the first page of that shirt, and you're going to scroll down, and you're going to see all kinds of other shirts on the bottom. And then you can just start brainstorming, getting ideas, and see what shirts are selling on on Amazon. You know what I mean? Or what people are clicking on to like looking at just different shirts and stuff like that so yeah so and this is one of the shirts I made too it's a uh, it says we are all you see it we are all, all immigrants all right it's a pretty cool one okay so uh, let's get straight into the video here we go all right uh, let's do dog very broad and then go from there so I'm gonna use all the everything I'm using in this video is gonna be free too as well so the dog dog click on it merch research all right and then I'm gonna show all merch all right scroll down dog mother dog mother and wine lover okay let's open this tab Alright, so, okay, this is the main page right here that we're looking at, okay, uh, see all, this, this right here is like, you can brainstorm off of this page right here, something very basic, um, you can do this with anything, so you can do a Halloween, you can do a Thanksgiving, Christmas shirts, and you can see what customers are actually clicking on, you know what I mean, so, let's scroll down, okay, this would be, well, so, well, this one right here, this shirt, I would make a, a design for this shirt right here and then you can scroll down and then you can see like related shirts to it okay this is like an old FBA Amazon FBA trick so like you can see like if the customer looked at like something like this they'll look at something down here too as well and you can just brainstorm from here so this has a sales rank as you can see right here all right as you can see and then you would come down here and then look at other shirts too as well see how it just comes around these are all these are all merch shirts right here okay okay and then what I would do is just come in here and just start opening up all these shirts uh I don't know that one I would kinda of stay away from this one and then I'll just open up all these shirts and I have all these shirts designs shirt designs that are actually have ideas now you know what I mean I have actual ideas of a shirt shirt that people are looking at on Amazon alright okay let's just go right there um, we're gonna question to come in here and brainstorm. Look at look at all these other links that I opened up, all the other tabs that I just opened up. Okay, um, it's not too much of a demand, but it's obviously it made it sell, and you can see if it's verified. So actually, a customer actually bought this shirt. That's the review. You can see the review. It's a verified purchase. But so there's actually at one time there was actually a demand for this shirt. Okay. I'm not too sure about this. Cat eat Doug. Let's look at that's their brand. I'm not sure exactly what that is. What I would do, see, every time I do this, I'll copy this, and then I'll have my TM. Always have my uh my TM Hunter open. What was that? And I just put it next to like where I search from. Okay. And then I'll. Just... Oh boom! No trademark. All right. That so that uh. That actual design, <clears throat> I'll make that cat staff design, okay? And then, of course, look at, remember, you can also come in here and you can click on the brand, too. I'm just doing all kinds of stuff that, like, sometimes I get stuck, too, with research. And then I'll just, like, actually go, like, watch TV for a little bit. And then I'll come back, like, okay, I can make this shirt. I can make that shirt. So, yeah. There's nothing in the brand. But do you see just how I'm just using the first product page and just brainstorming? And yeah, from there, you could just, the German Shepherd, of course, it's not going to be trademarked, but like, you see how simple this is? 
keep your team uh, hunt open and you can just yeah just do all kinds of trademark searches before you put the link in the spreadsheet for the designer that's like if you don't know what I'm talking about please go back and watch the rest of the videos that I've done let's see all right so we would make <clears throat> we'll make we'll copy the link and then put it in there for, to make that to make that actual to make this shirt and then this one too as well make the shirt similar to this if my design I'll send it to my designer if he can make something similar to this I'm not sure how he'll make this one better but uh, I'll send it to him see if he can if he can't then no and like I said to scroll down there's nothing actually no there's nothing there all right my heaven on earth This right here is very interesting. I'm not sure about this right here because what is this? I have to look more research into this. I don't know. I don't like this example right here. Let's go back in. Um, so you can obviously see. Um, I'm not sure if this is my heaven on earth. Hmm. I'm not sure. It looks because look, it's like the same. With the same dog in, in the below picture looks like it at least so it might be a cartoon character I'm not sure so let's go back and do this over okay let's start from the beginning hmm now this best dog ant ever let's come in here and see what this is about and you can just see what I'm doing okay don't make this confusing don't make it hard and I'm just I'm basically going in and brainstorming and see like and like I said just keep it keep your trademark your trademark uh team hunt right there and you can see what are what's trademark and what's not okay it'll pop up right here I'll say dead or alive and then you can click on it just to verify and make sure everything else is good but uh <clears throat> okay this one right here I'm gonna go down nothing on that one either um okay I'm trying to find you an example would be a good one. Let's go down there. I'd rather be home with my dog. And I'm I'm basically looking at sales ranks below 500 <clears throat> to kind of just give you an idea. Um, that's what I kind of look for, and uh, because it has a demand for it, it sold probably once or twice, or just sells keeps getting sales. You know what I mean? Throughout the year, I'd rather be home with my dog. That's that too, so I would actually so I'd rather be home with my dog. Some people they just they honestly they'll trademark some of the most stupidest things ever. But I understand why, but it's just sometimes it's just frustrating because you're like, ah, right, here's a perfect example. Um here's other shirts. But then here's well I already looked at those ones, but then look at customer who Customer who bought this brand also shop for, so they brought this brand, but not only that, now they're showing you related, related like, related shirts, to this niche, okay? Or yeah, I'm not sure exactly, but they just, look okay, at let me show you, so we'll click, these open up, look at we can literally open up all these, see how it just gives you more ideas. I'd rather be at home with my pet boy. I'd rather be home with my Dane. I'd rather be home with my husky. You see how you can literally go into every single like breed of dog and just break down and make 40 50 shirts you know what i mean okay of course it won't work for like the lower tiers that's what you guys need to find out uh if you're in a lower tier you better you got to figure out a way test a shirt you want to find that one shirt that's going to make you tons of sales so you got to find that one shirt that's going to make you sales to help tear up but once you get up into like 500 to a thousand literally these shirts right here are perfect examples of what you would find to help you make sales. You know what I mean? Because you just sub niched in into that category or into that niche. So Sundays are for softball. Look at there's all kinds of ideas right here. Do you see how I did all this? So like if people are having trouble finding shirt ideas, you literally go in all here and just look at and see if they have a sales rank. See if they're making sales or not. And I can just open up all these right here. 
But don't, we're not going to copy pixel for pixel. We're going to make it different. Okay, we're going to make a different shirt. We're not going to copy pixel for pixel. Okay. Yeah. And <clears throat> I would literally, like I said, I would literally open up all these. See all these tabs that I have open up? That's what exactly what I would do. And go in there and see what has a sales rank and see what's making sales. Okay, so yeah. Um, yeah, that's about it. Um, if you have any questions, comment below, like, and subscribe. Thank you.